Plus, I gotta tell you, washing the car is a lot cheaper than therapy. Now, the end goal of washing your car is to remove dirt and grime and make the paint clean and shiny. However, while that's extremely important, arguably what's more important is how you wash the car along with the products and the process that you use. Now, while the goal is to make the car clean and shiny, you also need to keep in mind that when you wash the car, you're touching the paint with a wash mitt and with a drying towel. You need to use high quality products and high quality technique to avoid instilling any swirl marks or scratches. Now, chances are, if you've ever walked past a vehicle in the sunlight or if you looked at your own paint with a flashlight, you'll see what we call swirl marks. Now, a lot of people describe these as spiderweb scratching. Whatever you wanna call it, it's the same thing. And these are thousands of shallow scratches that when light hits it, it forms a spiderweb effect. And frankly, it takes away from the appearance of your vehicle. So in this segment, I'm going to demonstrate the proper way to wash your vehicle. I'm not just going to use any car, I'm going to use my Ford Mustang because what better vehicle to demonstrate than my own?